What's going on guys? My name is Ghost and today I'm going to do a dual commentary with my friend Chaos. Uh, I'm going to play a little demonition, demonition, <laughs> demolition on firing range. So uh, introduce yourself, Sir Chaos. What's up guys? My name is Chaos, as Ghost has already gracefully said, and uh, I am a fellow YouTuber. I play the Call of Duties. The Call of Duties, <laughs> indeed. And uh, yeah, check out his channel after this uh, commentary. He's got some good stuff. And um, speaking of the Call of Duties, how, how are we feeling about Black Ops so far? Uh, I'm not feeling it. Um, I've already quit <laughs> and come back. Uh, I, I posted a video on my channel and I was just like, you know, fuck this game. I don't like this. And then I kind of got like, I don't know, I tend to do that with Call of Duty. I'll, uh, I'll like quit and get mad at it and then I'll come back to it. Because I love the game, It's just, but Black Ops just does not feel like, uh, like Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare 2 to me. It's just... Yeah, believe it or not, uh, I rage quit Call of Duty 4, I know that's like a sin, but um, I went from Halo 3, uh, actually Halo, the whole Halo series, that's that's where I started playing multiplayer games, and uh, I wasn't very good at COD 4, and after like a couple months I was like, this is stupid, I'm going back to Halo, but um, I just stuck with COD, and Black Ops so far, is it's kind of confusing because... Um, there's so much wrong with it, but I guess, you know, they're doing the patches. They have the one sound patch that didn't do much, but, you know, I mean, Trey do something and besides count the money that they made millions of dollars on, so. Yeah, I mean, it just doesn't feel right. Like, just the game in general, like, I guess, like, all the balancing issues are really, like, the balance, I think, is pretty good in comparison to most other Call of Duty games. Like, yeah, you have the Nike 74U, which is, I think it's just really easy to use, which is the thing that people don't like about it, and just, like, everybody mm -hmm. uses it, but, and, I mean, it is the best submachine gun, and then there's the G11, which is overpowered, but, I mean, they are taking steps to to do stuff with that and to, to nerf it down, but at the same time, it's just, like, it's not the balancing, and it's it's just, like, the feel of the game for me. I don't know about anybody else, but... Yeah, um, I feel like there's a couple wasted perks, in my opinion, like, have you ever seen anyone use Scout? No, I have not, because sniping is just I... so broken anyway. Yeah, I can honestly say after, like, two days online, I've never seen anyone use Scout at well, all. So. How often do you run into a sniper? Like, um, When I played Search and Destroy for about six games, um, people were sniping, but they were, they were absolutely terrible. Yeah. So... What's the point of it? I mean, like, I love sniping, too. Like, that was my thing in uh, Modern Warfare 2. Like, I was I was a, a quick scoper. I was a lead quick scoper. And, mm -hmm. I like, I loved doing that, and I loved that play style. And I just have no desire to pick up a sniper in this game. It's just fucking boring. Yeah. Oh, look, you got your doggies. Yeah. yeah, dogs, man. The hardline perk is so good. It's ridiculous. I'm honestly but, uh, a yeah. much bigger fan of Black Jacket. Because yeah, I, that's strange. I cannot stand getting killed by explosives. I don't know what it is, yeah. but I just I hate them. I, I think it might be Modern Warfare 2 uh, noob tube like reminiscing, because they're not reminiscing. That's a complete wrong word, but I just <laughs> <laughs> but uh yeah I can't stand explosives. If I die. I can honestly say um I haven't even used it at all. <laughs> Basically, you're in, you're almost invulnerable to any kind of explosion, explosives. I run through claymores all the time. Like, what does uh, Flak Jacket Pro do? Uh, <laughs> it resets the fuse on thrown back grenades, and I think it does oh, yeah. something else too, but I forget. But um, it's like the most unrealistic thing watching, ever. Yeah, I oh, dude, I was watching the top five plays and. and uh, I guess Hacker Pro gives you the ability to booby trap a care package, an enemy care package. Oh, I Did saw you know that. that, yeah. Yeah, and the dude gets like a quad just by like booby trapping yeah. it. Yeah. Almost want to um, just go ahead and try and get that just to do that. That would be a funny video. Yeah. You do that to all the but, um, care package abusers in this game. Yeah. Dude, look at this chopper gun. No, I'm like... watching it right now. It's tearing, <laughs> it's tearing <ridiculous>. assholes. <laughs> Oh my god. But, um, what's your favorite weapon so far? Um, honestly, I'm a big fan of the FAL. Um, and for submachine guns, I really like, uh, the MPL. Uh, just because I don't like using the, uh, the AK 74U that much. 
Yeah, I try not to use it. When I prestige, like right now I'm on prestige three. So that's what I'm going to use up to like level 26 or so. Just to, you know, keep my KD still up, but, you know, still get effective scores. Is that, is but, that the um, prestige with like the gay cow symbol? Uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, the, one of the prestiges. I think it's either three or four. And the symbol yeah, is like a yeah. bull or a cow or something. Yeah, it's a bull and, um... The one after it, I think it's the one with the uh, the axe, the dude holding the axe. Yeah, that one's sick. That's epic. I think I want to stay there, but I know I'm going to get bored. I'm just going to prestige all the way. So. Yeah, that's what happened with me in Modern Warfare 2. Uh, I actually I ended up staying at 7 for the entire time just because I didn't like any of the other symbols. Yeah. Yeah, I was at 9, and um, I was at 9 for about a month and a half, probably about two months, and then Double XP Weekend came, the first one. And I was like, ah, pff, might as well do it. <laughs> so, yeah. So, and then I, uh, the 10th Prestige, I did it in like a day and a half because the double XP was insane. Yeah. Like, this game actually encourages you to go for another Prestige, though, because they have, like, the Prestige playlists and, like, the gold camos and stuff, like, actual, like, legitimate things other than just extra class slots. Like, I'd love to see what the yeah. Prestige playlist is like, uh, like, Prestige Pure or something like that. Yeah, uh, apparently, um, I saw 418 people playing that the other day. I'm not quite sure. Yeah. I guess uh, there are 15 lobbies out. <laughs> that's just ridiculous. Yep. Yeah. That's that's one of the bad things about uh, playing a game this popular, though, is like it's just gonna get hacked like over and over again, especially on consoles, because like they they can only do so much on Xbox. Like they have to wait two weeks for a patch, so. Or something. Like that. Yeah, I hear, I hear Treyarch is gonna like uh, supposedly watch people's file shares in recent games if they're like boosting and banning them. I highly doubt that because I they, mean, there's thousands of people that boost. Yeah, but, and probably millions of people that boost. I mean, well, that's yeah. probably pushing it. But <laughs> uh, there, there. No, are man. A lot of uh, yeah, in Modern Warfare 2, uh, at one point I was about 4,000th in the world in, in the leaderboards. And then, like, four days later, I was, like, 80,000. And I was, like, what the hell? Yeah. <laughs> I was, like, I know these people didn't pass me overnight. Yeah. And I guess there was... Yeah. 10th lobbies blew up really quickly in Modern Warfare 2. Did you hear, like, there was a, the guy that... Or, not the guy, but one of the people that was really selling them started... He made a shit ton of money. Like, there was, like, like real, real money to be made in 10th in Prestige lobbies. That's just crazy. Yeah. I mean, and I mean, if you think about it, it's just an emblem in a video game. I know. Like seriously, why would <laughs> you ever pay money for that? That's stupid. Yep. But uh, this commando, uh, this, this is the really this map. Um, it's like long range and short range. Um, I mean, you can rush really effective in this map, but in demo. Uh, I like to like hunker down a position and just like watch noobs run at me. It's yeah. uh, and then look, two topper gunners. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, that's there's a huge difference between camping and like I mean, technically what you're doing is playing the objective. You're not letting people get near the bomb. So yeah, um, I did a video I guess a week ago where I was in Nuketown and I, I kind of hunkered down in a room for about 30 seconds and I, I got like a lot of flack over planting a claymore and just sitting there. I was like, <laughs> why are you serious? I mean, like... Well, Nuketown is the worst map to run around in because you're going to have a kid spawning on your ass every two seconds. Exactly. If if you run and go to Nuketown, I guarantee you're going to die at least 10 times. Yeah. At least. And if you don't, um, then you either got really lucky or you're just a god. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So... How do you feel about Sandy Ravage being number one in the leaderboards in Free For All? How crazy was that? My, my ball just wet. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, right? Yeah. But, He's really trying, too. <laughs> yeah. I mean, seriously, think about that, man. It's just like, oh, I got a text message. Go away. Um, Not like we haven't oh, had crazy. enough technical difficulties with this commentary already. <laughs> yeah. Chaos is on top of his roof doing this commentary to get a better signal. So. I am ghetto. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yep. But um, I actually got a uh, another friend of mine. His name's Militia, and apparently he got the fastest free for all the other day. So I'm gonna upload that to my channel also, so you guys can check that out. How fast was it? 
Um, I think it was a minute and 50 seconds. Holy shit, what map? Uh, Nuketown. Oh, Alright. <laughs> I did one in 2 minutes and 24 seconds, which was fairly fast, but, yeah. I mean, a minute 50 seconds, that's just, that's great. Yeah. What do you think about the, uh, what are they called, the, the matches against the bots, what are they called? Uh, combat training? Yeah. I think that's the best thing it's, ever. Um, I'm getting a lot of for me to play a veteran and just play against the veteran bots. Cause have you done that yet? Uh, I usually play against someone hardened just to warm up, like before I play a match. Cause I'm usually like rusty or my hands are cold or something, and just trying to get like get the yeah. feel of it. So I usually play them on hardened, but I've done it on veteran a couple times, and it's it's not easy. <laughs> no, it's like they all have aim bots. Yeah, it's it's crazy. They, all they, like, they do not bots. miss shots. Like even no, even on a recruit, if you stand in front of them, like and move around long enough, if they're sniping, they will hit you like first or second shot. Yeah, like the veteran guys with the dragon off, they they kill you in one hit. My it's God. insane. So people are like, do a free for all with nine people and win. I'm like, are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> I I can't beat AI. It's like I mean I've done it before, but. No, who wants to watch me die 20 times? It's yeah. ridiculous. I mean, it would be an interesting, interesting challenge, though, to see if you could, like, get a good kill-death ratio doing that. Yeah. Yeah, maybe I'll try it out. Yeah. This spot that you're sitting at right now is just, like, spawn central. They do not yeah, move they're, away they're, from that spawn. They're literally spawning in front of me in this bathroom. I call this the bathroom. That's my call out. Oh. I'm like, they're in the fucking bathroom! <laughs> I try not to play this map as much as possible. I despise this map. Yeah. I think it's worse I mean, than it Nuketown for spawns. Um, have you used the turret gun in this game? The um, Sentry gun? You know, the Sentry gun? I've yeah. used it a couple times, and it's a lot better than uh, Absolutely. it was in Call of Duty uh, or Modern Warfare 2. Yeah, I don't know if you can see that kill feed, but it's just um, Jay and Fat Duck, they set up Sentry guns on top of this building behind me. And, like, the moment they peek their head out, it's just instant death. Oh, yeah. Like, there's one guy right now. <laughs> <laughs> that's, what, that's what's really getting on my nerves about this game, though, is when you roll with a team and you are all moderately good at the game, you're not going to get a team of six every single time. You're going to end up playing against, like, three people, and you're going to fight over kills, and it's it's shitty. <laughs> yeah, look, the whole team left. I mean, we basically won it. And, uh... My final score is 76 and 4, but look at Fat Duck, 77 and 12. Yeah, Duck is a that beast. Was, <laughs> he really is. Like, um, I watched one of his recent free falls and I was like, what the hell? Yeah. I didn't know you were this good. Well, I think the one, one of the big but, things with Duck is he ran around with a sniper all the time in Modern Warfare 2. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, that's, that's basically it. That was 13 minutes of rambling. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> all right, but... uh. Thanks for stopping by. Check out Chaos's channel, and uh, I'll see you guys later. Later, guys.